Hey guys, what's up? I'm Shikha, the fashion and beauty blogger at Pinkula. So quite recently, we did a video on wedding trends for 2017, wedding and festive trends in your clothing. And a lot of you guys requested to do a video on what's trending in the jewelry scene. So today we have a couple of jewelry pieces that are really trending and you must include in your wedding and festive trousseau. Though jewellery trends do not change drastically and it's always better to stick to the classics when it comes to wedding and festive season, here are some options that you should try. The first one is tassel earrings. Tassel earrings are having a major moment. They're everywhere. Actually, tassel in itself is a huge trend this season. It's incorporated in clothes and can be worn in form of your earrings. Even tassel necklaces and bangles are having a huge moment this season. So you must try tassel earrings. Sonam Kapoor wore her tassel earrings with her Indian wear while Deepika Padukone and Kareena Kapoor Khan wore it with their western wear proving how versatile this piece of jewellery is and it will really be worth your money. The next trend is kind of an extension to tassels and it is shoulder dusters. Shoulder dusters are in major spotlight this season and are a must add to your jewellery box. Subtle jewellery is so passe, in the jewellery department the spotlight is really shifting to oversized baubles. Shoulder dusters are basically earrings that are really big and oversized and come up to your shoulders, hence the name shoulder dusters. Next up is flower jewellery. Floral and jewellery made out of flour is big this season, especially to wear to your mehendi. Whether it is celebrities or a bride that you spotted on Instagram, all of them are embracing this trend. Nothing is more beautiful than nature, right? So why not incorporate it in your jewellery? Divyanka Tripathi DIY'd her own mehndi earrings when she wore earrings made out of flowers for her mehndi function. Also, Bipasha Basu was seen wearing a floral tiara with some really pretty flower earrings for her mehndi as well. Another major way how brides are incorporating flowers in their trousseau and their attire is by wearing floral dupatta that is basically a dupatta made out of roses and mogras. Not only does it look stunning but will also keep you smelling fresh and beautiful all day. Next up is Jurao, Kundan and Polki. Jurao historically was a practice of really integrate craftsmanship in Rajasthan and Gujarat in the Mughal era. Now, Kundan involves a technique of gem sets with gold foil between them. Kundan essentially means highly refined gold and is made of highly refined molten gold. Now, many people confuse Jarao with Kundan, Polki and Meenakari work, but they're actually different though they look very similar. Let me explain the difference to y'all so you guys can be well educated and know better when you go jewellery shopping. Kundan is jewellery that's embedded with glass beads. Polki uses the same technique but the only difference is that instead of glass, they use uncut diamonds called Polki. Meenakari on the other hand is a technique of using enameling in jewellery and Jarao is kind of an amalgamation of Polki, Meenakari and Kundan. Now Jarao technically means to be embedded. It's kind of a style and technique used by artisans to craft this sort of jewellery but it does vary a little bit from Kundan work. The next trend is Matha Patti. It's more of a hair accessory that you wear over your head. It's like a headgear. It's the perfect crown for the queen that you are. And also that little pearl bindi or diamond or kundan bindi that comes in the center of your forehead is a beautiful point of focus and will make for stunning pictures. Next up is chokers. Chokers are not only for your casual day wear to look grunge, but they also come in several Indianized versions. You can use them in your choice of stone. The options are endless and add the perfect touch of chic to your outfit. Next up is also a headgear or a hair accessories and these are chapkas or pashas. Pashas or chapkas are essentially beaded jewellery that you wear on one side. They're very Mughal and royal and instantly add a touch of royalty to your bridal look. They've been worn by several celebrities such as Meera Rajput who wore it for her wedding. Now if those big pashas or chapkas are too much for you then there's this another cute option called as Rajkumari pashas that are a tinier version and they look really cute for all the younger girls out there. 
Next up is the elegant double layer. The lyrical double stranded trend on layering your jewelry is a really popular one. Here's how you can incorporate it. Either you could wear a matha patti which has a double layer or you could wear your choker style necklace and pair it with a longer necklace to give the double layer effect. Now here's another cool jewelry trend that you can try. This is kind of an extension of the matha patti and it is a one-sided matha patti. So it goes all the way to the back and is on one side. It looks really quirky and chic and is a trend that you must try and also it will make for amazing side profile pictures. Speaking of your fingers, you could also try the super cool trend of hand harness. They're basic rings that are attached to your wrist. So it's like a bracelet and a ring combination and it serves a double purpose. Another really cool trend that the girl who loves wearing rings can try is to wear midi rings and to layer your rings. So basically stack them on, stack them on and your hands will be all jeweled and you can keep the rest of the accessories simple and dance the night away. And that's it guys, those were some of the jewelry trends that you must add to your wedding and festive trousseau this season. If you guys want to see any more festive and wedding season videos, let us know in the comments below and we'll be glad to do it. If you want to shop for the latest celebrity trends and looks, you have to log on to Pinkwilla Shopping. If you like this video, then don't forget to leave a like, share it with your friends and subscribe to Pinkwilla. Also, hit the bell icon to get latest notifications on new videos.